Example 6.1 Prove that when a reflecting surface of light is tilted by an angle theta, the reflected light will be tilted by an angle 2 theta. Okay. So, here we have to prove the reflecting surface of light is tilted by an angle theta. So, this is your reflecting surface. Okay. Now, AB is your reflecting surface. So, we can write AB reflecting surface. Now, when light is incident at an angle O. So, this is the point O. So, here IO is the incident ray. So, OR1 is the reflected ray. Now, I is the angle of incidence. So, that is the angle made by the incident ray with the normal. Okay. And this is equal to that of the angle of reflection. This is equal to that of the what? Angle of reflection. So, we can write I is the angle of incidence equal to angle of reflection. Okay. Now, the reflecting surface is tilted by an angle theta. Now, I can go for the next diagram here. Now, initial position of the reflecting surface is AB. Now, your new position is A dash B dash. New position is what? A dash B dash. So, we can write surface AB is tilted to A dash B dash by an angle theta. So, the angle between A dash B dash and A is what? Theta. Okay. So, now the normal is also tilted by an angle theta. It is normal is also angle tilted. That is normal N is tilted by an angle theta. Okay, so here the normal is n dash. So your new normal is what? n dash. You can see it in the diagram here. This is n dash. This is for a dash b dash. So what is your reflected ray now? The incident ray is same. The incident ray is what? Same. Okay. So the reflected ray is O R2. O R2 is the reflected ray. Okay. Now, so what is the angle between N and N dash? N and N dash is theta. So this angle is theta. Okay. Now here you can see this angle is I. This angle is theta. So what is this angle? So this angle is I minus theta. Okay. Now. What is the angle between I and N dash? So, this angle. This is I, this is theta. So, this is I plus theta. So, what is the angle between R2 and N dash? So, this angle. This is also what? I plus theta. Since this is I plus theta, this will also be what? I plus theta. This is your incident ray and angle between incident ray and normal. Here this is the angle between normal and the reflected ray. Okay. So, now we can write the angle between. You can go for writing, finding the angle between. O R2 and O R1. 
O R two and O R one. So that is ankle R one O R two. Ankle R one O R two is ankle N dash O R two minus ankle N O R one. Okay, N one R one. Now here, what is N dash O R two? N dash O R two. That is what I plus theta. Okay. What is N O R one? N O R one. That is I minus theta. Okay. N dash O R one is what? This is also N dash O R one minus I minus theta. This is I plus theta. This is I minus theta. Now add these two. What you are getting here is i plus theta, i minus theta. So here two theta, i and i will get what cancel. So you are getting it as what two theta. So what is this angle? There is angle between r one and r two. The angle between r one and r two is two theta. So now we have proved. What is the question? When an Reflecting surface is tilted by an angle theta. The reflected light is also tilted by an angle two theta. So we have proved the question.